What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix Battlefield 6 error. This application was unable to start correctly while you're launching the Battlefield open beta either on your Steam or on your EA Sports. You might be getting this error and how we can fix this error. So let me directly get into a step. So the first one is all about if you're having this trouble, you have to minimize both Steam or EA Sports. Then go over here search for windows security and click on the windows security once it load up just go to app and browse control now go to under expert protection click on expert protection setting now from here go to program setting now as you can see we need to add the game exe file so in my case i have already added this so let me remove this and i'll show you how we can add it so this is how it looks like by default for the first time then click on plus icon now go to choose exact file exact path now go to this pc now we need to navigate to the game installation folder so in my case the game is installed on e so go to the game directory steam library steam apps common now select glacier events then this is the exe only this you have to add here so select this one and you have to add it after add you will be given this particular box which says for program setting then you have to put a check on this box make sure you turn this off and you have to do the same for every everything until the bottom you have to put a check turn this off put a check make sure this is turned off put a check put a check on this box turn this off put a check on this box turn this off you have to put a check and if it is turned on turn this off you have to turn this off you have to put a check on this box and turn this off you have to put a check on turn this off turn off all these things you have to turn this off you have to turn this off as well and go over here turn this off turn this off we have to put a check turn this off whatever turn it on you have to turn this off and you have to put a check on all these boxes then you have to change it's required you to restart before this one so go to apply now go for yes now we can see it is added now we can go to the steam then launch the game or if you're on the battlefield for ea sports you can launch the game and check but few in the above video which i recently uploaded one of the subscriber commented and stated why they did this it made them the situation worse so if that is the case if you after doing this if your situation is getting more and more worse then what i'm recommending is you can remove it you can revert it so to do so just remove it click on the remove so it will be removed from here you have to remove it then you can follow the next instruction now the next one is all about you have to minimize everything next one is all about we need to allow the game to the antivirus if you're having any third party antiviruses like mcafe you know avast bit defender if you have any kind of antivirus just add the game exe file to it or go over here to the control panel windows defender firewall allow an airport feature through windows defender firewall keep scrolling down make sure the battlefield is added so in my case, the Battlefield 6 open beta is added. You have to put a check on both about private and public. Then you have to check. If you don't know how to add, just click on change setting. Go to allow another app. Go to the browse. Navigate to this PC. Go to localist D. Steam library, Steam apps, comment. Now from here, you have to go to scroll down. Sorry, I think the game is on E. Steam library, Steam apps, comment. Go to Glacier events. Now from here, you have to select this and add it. Once add, you have to put a check on both the box, private and public. That's very important. You have to put a check on both the box, public and private. Then you have to launch the game. Similarly, you can also add. You can also try adding this one. So if I go to mention, you can also add EA Anti-Cheat Game Service Launcher. You can add this, this as well. And also add EA Anti-Cheat Installer. You can add this as well. Then you have to check. That might work. Next one is we need to create a new local user account. So just go over here, search for the settings. Click on the settings. I don't know how this is going to help you guys out. I haven't tried it. But uh, in the forums, in many forums like Reddit and Quora, even in the Steam community, I, I saw this stuff. So that's why I'm showing you. We can go to accounts. Now from here, you have to scroll down. And there is an option called other user. Now you can see this is my only user. So you have to create a user. Then you have to create all the details. You can create a user with email or phone. Then you create a local user. Then you have to switch back to that. Then check while launching the game. That might help as well. So these are the steps and it's a quick video. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe. See you soon next video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.